Hello everyone, welcome back to Virtual Pool for Nine Ball Action. In the UK Championships, we're down to the final three, playing Albin Ocean in the final three, uh, with a winner to go up against Jason Shaw, uh, so the two of the strongest CEOs um, in the game. Race to seven for this match today. Uh, but I want to start, because this will come out on the uh, 23rd. So I want to start by wishing you all a very Merry Christmas. I hope you're all ready to rock. Uh, I am uh, very grateful for the, the good wishes in regards to my new job. Look where the purple's gone. And um, he needs to move this with a lot of right-hand side. It's not a bad effort. It is not a bad effort. Ooh, and very close indeed. And he's got the second prize, so a good shot, really. Um, but yes, thank you so much for the good wishes. Uh, I'm looking forward to getting started in the new year. Oh, well, I've <laughs> I've got safe a little bit there, and I think I might have knocked the five in bother as well, so I've definitely got second prize. And he missed, so that's uh, <laughs> perhaps not completely deserved, but the the orange does go in both pockets, so here you just give yourself plenty of angle, and just, uh, I always think a trace of right-hand side just helps to keep it from heading straight towards the pocket and then that is exactly what I do so that was a really hideous shot um, and also thanks to everyone for all the all the kind comments you guys have been putting on my on my videos uh, perhaps not about that shot um, but yeah I'm all I'm looking forward to Christmas I have got a little bit of a cold you know that you can tell uh, I thought I was gonna get really ill yesterday I uh, had a bit of a stupid night um, but I feel okay I just my nose is running a little bit. I'm hoping I'm over the worst of it. I haven't had any paracetamol since earlier today, so if I was gonna feel really crap, then I think I would have been by now. Um, but no excuses, That's not. if I lose this game, that's not gonna be the reason why. Um, in terms of other updates, uh, one a friend of mine is, is, is trying to buy a football club, and is interested in me becoming a coach again, uh, which is, Something I didn't expect. I'm not sure that I'm really going to be able to do it. I think I need to focus on my my own fitness journey rather than other people's. Um, but it may be something that you know we can sort something out. I'd be an assistant manager. Um, that's not going to drop. I knew as soon as I hit that. God damn. <clears throat> so yeah. So I wonder what are your what are your New Year's ambitions, everybody? Uh, put in the comments. I'd love to hear what your New Year's resolutions or ambitions it's always a good idea to restart not necessarily relating to pool you know i'll be interested to hear whatever you're doing uh, i know you guys always take an interest in what i'm up to i'll certainly reciprocate that and uh you know let me know what your plans are um always good to have them at the same time always good not to get too upset if you don't do much with them because it's you know it's hard to change and uh yeah, mine, mine are pretty much obviously with a new job to get, be a bit more social, do a bit more fitness, health and fitness, eat better. Um, keep playing, keep enjoying playing snooker and pool. To do it, I'm, I'm lucky that I've kind of now reached an income level uh, where I can realistically plan for, for that loft conversion. Um, I don't know when that might be, but certainly in a year's time, it may well be feasible. And... If I want to increase my my YouTube output, because at the minute and by and by the way, this is in no way, shape, or form. That is a nice shot. Come on, Mal. Come on. In no way, shape, or form, a, a, any critique of anything that I do. That was a nice shot. Mike going off. Oh, look where he's got the blue as well. I think you've just got to duck here. Um, hit as thick as you can. Just the problem you have here is actually the eight ball. That might not be hard enough. Got to hit the cush, man. Come on. Uh, this might. This sometimes happens when I'm thinking about blogging more than playing. Um, that's a good shot as well. Oh, it's superb. This could be the end of the line in regards to this tournament. When you get down to the later stages, you know you've got to play well. And the CEOs, forget the names. As one person been asking about playing, I can. If you email me, I can send the files. Um, 
probably need an update at some stage, but that is not on my list. That was not on my to-do list right now. Um, I got a comment of someone who asked if I'd sell them. Well, they're not really mine to sell, so I wouldn't sell them. I'm quite happy to share the ones I've I've used. At some stage a while back, I spent ages updating them, but it was when I was off work. So, right, we need to get going here because I I'm not playing very well. I've not really had a chance to do anything yet. Sometimes the balls just don't run for you. Sometimes they do. That could stop. Oh, it's just poked its nose out. That could have been the turning point we needed. I think we should get our hand on the table. I haven't really had an open chance yet. It can happen. It's it's not uncommon. Your computer just turns up and you find yourself blocked out for you know, a good chunk of the game. I used to get mad about it, but actually, I value now. Having played Madden, which is like, once you go behind in American football on that game, it's just so hard to... It's hard to just get, get good at it where you can make a comeback, you know? And if you play in a game like chess, for example, and you, you play against a, the computer of a certain strength, it just you just can't beat it. <laughs> you just can't. Um, I'm not about playing it at, like, you know, super grandmaster strength, but I'm all about if you're, say, a 1500 strength, which I'm not, but if you are, and you play a 1700 strength computer, like, you're probably going to lose most of the time. It's not a game that allows for... Oh, that's unbelievable. That's a bit frustrating. I'm not catching any breaks here. So I'm just going to play along the cush here. Just leave it. Whoever leveled that table out did it well. And then try and just leave it safe again. I'm just looking for like a a break at this stage. Right, I should get on the table now. Right. So oh, look at that two ball, dude. Right, I'm going to go for three fouls here. I'll take a... Uh, does it, am I being stupid? It's not actually abundantly obvious how, how I do that. Of course he hit it. Well... <clears throat> This is my first chance to clear a few balls. That was a dodgy shot. I didn't want to overcook that. And I thought I had. So leave myself an angle here. A little bit of right hand side. Gotta be careful not to overthrow it. Didn't play that well. Wanted to follow through and have the black into that pocket. Now if I do that I'll be snookered, so I've gotta come back over the table. Which was, you know, I've done it well, but it was a lot harder than the shot I should have had, which was just a, just a roll through. But I've taken these well. If I'd have messed that up and uh, gone five nil behind, that would have been almost game over at this stage. I really could do a seen a ball go here. Seven is horrible. Now, a bit of a characteristic of this match has been every time the computer's missed, he's put a ball really safe. That was a good shot. So was that. So now I've got the problem with the red. Okay, what I'm going to try and do here is move the green and then off the blue, play it in off, thin off the off the seven to open that up as well. So it's an attempt over two shots to open everything up. 
Okay, first part's failed. I'm not sure I can even get behind the three. This might be disastrous. No, oh, sod. Right, I'm, gonna try and, I'm still going to try and hit the seven. Oh, and I hit it. Seven hit the white. I might have moved the red, maybe. Now I've got to play like a stun shot off the cush. No, nope, that's gone wrong. I need help off the green. I don't think I've got it. Oh no, I did. Have a look at that. He's played a great shot. That's superb. I might be able to jump this. Maybe. I don't know if I can. It's not the most realistic shot in the world, but to be honest, a win's a win. No, I couldn't do it. Rat. The very small margin there, there might have been just a little bit. Maybe just a little bit more I could have got out of that. But now we're looking like we're going to really get hammered here. Interesting what he does here. He can either go for the black into the open pocket or he can play for the the plant. I don't think he'll miss either. The worst thing in the world is to land halfway between. He's played very well the leaving the open pocket, so this frame is done. So we're five one behind. Oh, and he's getting well I was gonna say he's getting breaks, but the one's covered now, but if he pots it, plants it, we'll probably he's probably get out here as well. Where's the white ball? Now, I don't know about you, but I feel like that's lucky because he lost the white there. That is not in. Okay, so another chance. Feels, feels thin. I've tried to leave myself a cut to hit the nine full. I don't want to go in off here. I hope I don't. I don't think I do. And I missed it. Oh dear. Great shot. I haven't made many mistakes. But it's just one of those games where I just haven't been able to do anything. When he's when he's missed. He's covered balls. Yeah, just had a good kicking really. And he hasn't made any egregious mistakes like when he's been mopping up he's done a good job of it so the chances of a comeback i would suggest are very small I don't feel too bad about it really, because it's just one of those games where i haven't been able to do anything and his, his safety has been really good too I've got to hit this, otherwise he's going to get the combo. Maybe a bit of light at the end of the tunnel. Maybe not. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's lovely. Sometimes when you're playing in a real match, pro match from years ago, you watch your opponent do something like that and you just know they're not going to miss. It's just dialed in and you think, yeah, this is over. And they make it look, it feels terrible when you're playing against someone like this because just, you just can't do anything. That feels like that's over hit. But it isn't. Wow. So quite a short video guys um i get 90 ranking points for finishing third let's see what the final had in store alban actually beat jason twice and won um first match fairly dominant she had a bit of a flurry in the middle and then 10-4 uh I think it was what four five four and then won the last five racks was it yeah just 
yeah, you just catch a CEO in good form sometimes. So let's see what that's done with the with the rankings. So I should be doing reasonably well. Oh, I'm actually top, Greggy. That's weird. Um, so doing well. Uh, what is the next one? Well, it's actually the shootout. So uh, that's always entertaining. So that'll be the next nine ball video, which I'm going to post. I'm going to post that one uh, in two days. So I might post that one if I do anything. If I go out in the first rack, which I did once play this where the computer broke off Golden Break and that was it. But the shootout is a little fun one that I've put in before the the bar table tournaments uh, where it's just a, a one rack shootout. Um, and I've won it a couple of times. And I think uh, the winner gets 300 ranking points, I think. Can't remember how, no, not 300. Um, maybe 150 or something but that's the only one when it takes all so there's no prize money which doesn't matter does it i mean it's prize money you, unfortunately you can't cash it out because uh i would be uh, 1.3 million dollars richer than i am which would be quite nice to keep cashing out a million bucks when you play a game uh but there my statue i've gone over the 10,000 excellent uh 20 24% over 10,000 racks breaking dish that's pretty good over 1200 breaking dishes um yeah not bad 96 percent on nine balls missed quite a few of them consecutive run outs so yeah not bad not bad um games played ten thousand. never gets old you know i really enjoy playing anyway that's it shoot out next video hope you enjoyed it uh sorry i played well kind of bad there um but like i say i hope you all have a, a fabulous christmas and new, and new year there will be more videos i'm going to keep going uh, I think the next one will probably be uh, an eight ball video, possibly. I'll check, so I like to keep them spread out, and then maybe a, a, a snooker video to come as well. So I'll try and keep keep going over Christmas. So you've got plenty to watch if you enjoy watching these, um, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks, thanks for everything.